Hey everyone, King 77 here from the ACS team here to do a video showing you how to get the Ice Cream Sandwich Android 4.0 keyboard on your Android device. Uh, this is basically what keyboard, the keyboard that will come with Android 4.0. So it's very nice. You don't need to be rooted. You can be on stock or rooted. So definitely be sure to share this with your friends, uh, anybody that does have an Android phone. But all you have to do is go to the market and search for ICS keyboard. So I just typed in ICS keyboard right there. So select it, hit apps, and then basically uh, the one by VLLWP right there. Um, select it, and then hit download. Download it and accept and download, and then go back, and then actually get the user dictionary too. So you're gonna need the dictionary as well, just so you uh, basically, it can auto-correct for you. Um, otherwise, download both of those. Once they're done downloading, Shouldn't take too long for me, I'm on Wi-Fi, hopefully. Once we're done downloading, I'll go ahead and give you a quick demo of it. All right, so as you can see, both are downloaded and installed, and we're good to go. I'm gonna go ahead and clear them. All you're gonna have to do now is just hit Menu, and then go to Settings, and then go to uh, Language and Keyboard right here. Select it, and then basically you're gonna need to check the ICS keyboard, Ice Cream Sandwich keyboard, hit OK and then just hit ICS keyboard settings. Um, basically, uh, you don't have to hit ICS keyboard settings, uh, but just so you know, there are some settings that really, um, they're basically all the settings that do come with your ice cream sandwich keyboard. So we're gonna need to enable it, so just go to select input method, and then just select ICS keyboard right there. And once you're done there, you're actually good to go. Um, you should be able to type and uh, have the ICS keyboard. So I'm gonna go ahead and go to the market again. Select the market, and here it is, ICS keyboard right there. So uh, very nice theme job. Uh, they definitely made some improvements to this keyboard. It uh, it works very well. I've used it on my Nexus S um, 4G, and it works really great. A little theme different from the gingerbread keyboard when you press it, a nice blue pop-up right there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and go to, let's see, somewhere. Um, I'm going to go to my messaging, actually. All right, and now that I'm in my messaging, I'm gonna go ahead and just compose a message and hit uh, enter a message. And I'll just uh, type something. I'll just say, hey, how is it going? Hey, uh, this is really difficult with the camera in front of me, but hey, how is it going? So there you go, right there. Just uh, just like that, it should auto-correct for you. Everything should work well. Um, this is a nice keyboard. There you go. Everything. I'm. Not, I, I don't even think I'm typing it in right. I doubt I spelled a bunch of those right, just because it's difficult with this camera in front of me. But as I said, pops up with options right here that you can select, and then you got your question mark, comma, and you. I, no, I guess you can't slide this back and forth. But either way, exclamation point, question mark, just the main used ones. Um, but otherwise, very nice. You got uh, obviously different options. Um, but I definitely would recommend trying this out. It, it works very well. I definitely like it a lot. I like the theme of it and just the functionality of it as well. It does work very well. Um, but otherwise, be sure to check it out. Uh, let me know what you think of it as well. Leave a comment on the video. I'd be happy to hear what you guys think. Uh, definitely share this to everyone that does an Android phone uh, so they can see it in action and know that it's in the market. But otherwise, uh, thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like it.